going to start by interlacing your hands so the palms are facing you. And press the hands away. Just feel the space in between your shoulder blades. Little spider. Oh, okay. It's probably a fourth widow. So interlace space between the shoulder blades. At this point you can do a couple of things. You can drop your head or it might be that you want to kind of rock back so that you're on the back right. of the sit bones. Yes? Yes? What? I'm hungry. You're hungry. You just give me one minute. No, it's okay. I can wait. Okay, so interlacing your hands, pressing here. So head can drop forward, so we've got more of a C shape. And then we can think about taking the pelvis back. So we're leaning back on the sit bones, or we're kind of more on the butt, if that makes sense. We're thinking about lead, taking our weight back. So the belly's really soft, and we really take it into the lower back, if that feels right. As we inhale, we find the length of the spine. So really focus on straightening, bending of the elbows and make a really beautiful kind of little shelf for your head. As you exhale, press straight back into your hands, creating a little bit of resistance. Inhale to release. Exhale, head presses straight back. Inhale to release. Exhale, straight back. Inhale to release. From here, this time, we're going to stay with interlaced hands, but take them so they face the ceiling. Option, you can stay here. It might be that as you stretch and reach and find a little bit of lower length, you might take hold of one wrist. And I like to really pull the skin away from the armpit. So kind of grab hold and squeeze. And then if you pull from there, you'll get a really nice sense of superficial fascia moving away from some of the deeper layers. And then take it into a side stretch. Inhale as you come over. Again, squeeze, pull down. Inhale, exhale, arms come either side of you, interlace, leaving your fingers like so, and then coming into a back bend. So really focusing on lifting through the chest, finding some space in the sternum and all the ribs on the front side of the chest, and squeezing the shoulder blades as much as they're happy to together. And again, it might be that you stay here, it might be that you extend the head. And just like we did when we started, the opposite. So now you come into the front of your sit bones. And then reset. Namaste. You can do the other side.